everybody, Terry Cruz and Tyler Beast here. Welcome to the second game of the NBA Playoffs on 2K Sports. Now we're ready to send you down as we got the next game going underway. It's Dallas Mavericks facing against the Los Angeles Clippers. Right at this moment, the Dallas Mavericks have already made a win. And this was no ordinary on the show. They definitely have done that one before. And they haven't been really been playing so long since playing season three. But this time, they're looking to see if they can get two or, or for one. The Los Angeles Clippers want to see if they can get their teams back so they can tie this series game up. So it might be one way, but what will they do? You'll never know, because this might be a close-up game that you'll ever find out who they are. The next commentaries I will have is Kevin Harlan along with Craig Anthony, and of course we have this David Aldrich here on the sideline, and the rest of the 2K sports crew. We'll be back with the halftime to show you as Ernie Johnson, Kenny Smith, and Chap O'Neill are all ready to be out here for the halftime show, and we'll be back with the post-game show. Now let's get you on here at Los Angeles at Crypto.com Arena. Enjoy the second game, everybody. And right now, here they are. Let's take you down to Kevin Harless, Kawhi Leonard, and a team are ready to rally up here at Los Angeles. Okay, sports. NBA action is coming up. A broadcast team tonight. On one side, Greg Anthony. On the other side, Steve Smith. On the sideline, David Aldridge. I'm Kevin Harless. So let's take a look at the starters for the Dallas Mavericks. The star backcourt of Doncic and Irving are out there. P.J. Washington is out there with Derek Jones, and it's Gafford in at the center, filling out the middle. And for the Clippers, man in a chain guard with George at small forward. Down the block, it'll be Kawhi next to Zubox, and it's Harden in at the point guard. Well, certainly some names on the floor, Greg, that we've seen in the NBA for many years. Then in consideration, what kind of game can we expect with a grizzled group on the floor? And, and Kevin, these types of games tend to be kind of methodical. The vets are afraid to get the ball up for a better look, and we should see a clean game here tonight. Just five on the clock. Here's Gafford. That shot is off. Good team by Harden. Zubox finds Harden. Here's Mann. Leonard on the way. Passes to Harden. Puts up a deep three. Kept alive. Zubox, the best of man. Over Irving. Out of bounds. Clippers Out of bounds. Clippers, Clippers ball. Second chance shot. Ball George. George has got the first two. Scoreboard for the Clippers. Uh, excellent uh, decision. He can box with you, sis. As the ball was coming, he was firing right away. Now, here is Irving. Tight defense on him. Los Angeles ball. Those kids are supposed to go. The Mika Zubox, number 40. First team comes. First free throws here tonight. I don't know, the Dallas Mavericks, very early, two shots. One falls for. And Smitty, we know when it comes to the Clippers, they seem to go as Kawhi Leonard goes. No doubt, Kevin. The only year they didn't make the playoffs with him, he was hurt. But when he's healthy, they are dangerous. That one is it, so he goes one for two. Such a crafty player. You'll never know what you're going to see from Kyrie when you come to the arena. Back to London. George passes to Mann. 
over Jones. Man. Terrence Mann. Moving the ball. Love to see this kind of offense. And so just over a minute and a half played. Here's Irving. The shots. Darby. Irving. This is a guard. Tyree is as good get. as anyone inside. Unreal finish around the rack. Outside left. Back to Hardy. George against Jones. Here's Hardy. Number 77, he needs to get it. His first personal foul. Without foul. Without foul. He's constantly seeking out time. And the line for the Clippers. James Harden. First trip to the line. And the line for two. weapons this league has ever seen still it's got the skills Harden hits them both we've seen him put a lot of pressure on the defense and they cash in at the line and the Mavericks with possession they trail by three the try by Dungeon. Luka Doncic. And inside, Luka knows the bucket is there, so he is willing to fight for it. Outside, George. Arden looking it over. Evinka Zubox. And James Harden with the six. And where's the help? Defensively, no excuse. You have to be aware. He should be on your radar all the time. It's Luka the Doncic for three. And we know Doncic has limitless range, but for him, it's about becoming more consistent from deep. Harden up top, Harden by Doncic, and here's Leonard from three. That one's no good. Oh one to begin the game. In the corner, Irving with it. Fires for three. It's hauled in by Los Angeles. Here's Harden. What a tremendous game he played against Cleveland. And that was the whistle of the legal screen. He was too big to do that. News of additional on the court. For the Clippers, number 44, Mason Plumlee. The Mavericks have gone three of five, shooting the ball so far. Irving with the ball. Now, guarded by Plumlee. He hits Kyrie Irving. The contact is not enough to prevent Kyrie Irving from hitting the shot. That's pure determination. Ask a man. George with the ball. Defended by Jones. Some nice passing here by Los Angeles. Plumlee trying to break loose. James Harden! I just love how reliable he is. Night in and night out, this offense is there. Right at the free throw line. And the Luka Doncic. Right, right there. And then when Luka sees the big LA line, Clippers, side out. Takes the shot, keeping things simple. And the Clippers decide to take their first time out here. Believe it or not, the regular season is almost over. Great for teams that are out of the playoff picture. What's important now? Well, I, I think, Kevin, first you need to self-evaluate. Yeah. Check out your roster, who do you keep, who do you let go, and then once you figure that out, you start thinking about which guys to bring in.
on the start of the playoffs. Let's see how the rest will be won. You look at the Clippers. They've had a great season. And will look to extend that into the playoffs. And check out Dallas. Right on their heels and with their sights set on game ground. Yeah, I think the Clippers, they have to be considered one of the teams to watch for here in the postseason. Not many teams have accomplished more this season. Now it is Harden. Kawhi Leonard unable to get his shot to go. Five to shoot. Harden gets the joy. Los Angeles with a fresh shot clock. Harden, no good. And it's Irving with the ball for the Mavericks. Doncic passes to Gafford. There's the pass to Irving. He takes it in. It's deflected, and he recovers it. For Los Angeles, they've gone 4-10 shooting the ball here in the first quarter. Outside left, pass to Mann. That doesn't go in. Had a chance, though, to take the lead. The Mavericks have gone 5-9 from the field here in the first. Here's Jones, and he goes right over Mason. Derek Jones, Jr. It's a job. Oh, that's an old-fashioned rim right uh, Just a remarkable jam. These fans' jaws are on the ground right now. Nice angle on that replay with the AT&T 5G slam cam. They can use a big shot here to get this offense going. Too many empty possessions. Right now, they need a basket. George finds Leonard. It's rebounded by Doncic. And his pure defensive effort changed that shot. From an easy one. Daniel Gunford. And you know, this is a high level game. But this is why we play the game. And, and certain guys dictate the pace of the game. Doncic, as much as anyone. Clippers with the ball. Following the score by Dallas. Back to Harden. And again, it's the Clippers missing. And, and close to making the defense pay for the lax coverage that time. Jones kicks to Doncic. It to Gafford. It is good. Daniel Gafford. Gafford's got his oh, second ball. Luka Doncic. They get scored on. LA Clippers timeout. It's come from inside the paint. And the Clippers call time here. Credit where credit is due. P.J. Washington is one hardworking guy on the floor. Isn't he great? He's got that greatness to him, Kevin. Values every chance he gets to affect the game. And like you said, he puts a ton of effort into his play. Three! Russell Westbrook! 
making threes. I don't know how you guard him. Hardaway passes to Lively. Defense! Defense! Now, here's Cleaver, guarded by Tucker. Outside Hardaway. Off line with his three. And this is what you like about his perimeter team. He never gave up and challenged the defense. to compete through the entire play. Defense! Separating the shot clock. Defense! Here's Exum. Rebounded by Tucker. The Clippers have gotten seven of their first 16 field goal attempts to go down here in the first. Doncic against Westbrook. Picked off in midair. Just three on the clock. That one, no good. And that's the end of the first quarter. The first quarter comes to Dallas the Mavericks. Running on top. The Los Angeles Clippers. 18. In a moment, as we'll get underway with quarter number two. Some good action already in this one, but a fairly even matchup after the first quarter of play. And some stats here, guys. The scoring breakdown for Dallas. Right out of the gates, they've been in attack mode. And I think that's by design because it has been relentless. And also, guys, they're out muscling their opponent. The points in the paint are piling up because of that aggressiveness. And so Westbrook will bring it up for Los Angeles. Trailing by two. So with Harden on the bench, here's who Teron Lewis going with. George and Leonard are the forwards. Roman Powell is out there with Russell Westbrook. And Zubat sit at the five, down low. Six to shoot. Fires from the line. Russell Westbrook. Got it all tied up now for the ground. Norman Powell with the assist. From that distance. A moment now to hear from our sideline reporter, Hall of Famer, David Ola. David. Thank you, Kevin. Welcome. Maverick Spall. Master of one-on-one -on -one isolation scoring. Jason Peterson, you know, this is a on the door. Sometimes as a coach, you want to run all these plays, but at the end of the you day, you are no old. Stop getting the enough time to and Brady Clippers. Kevin, Number one, James Harden. Report. James Harden, he's checked in for Russell Westbrook. The Mavericks also with a substitution. Here's Jason Peterson. Washington against Leonard passes it to Irving. To the middle, here's Green. Count the bucket coming up. Josh Green. This is a boy. Just no, no resistance. Now you're the inside. That's their fifth consecutive make in the paint. Here's Harden. And the Shades. Harden. More coming up. Daniel Lestal, number 11, in. Kyrie Irving. His first personal foul. First team foul. On the night, he's gone two for two at the strike. And a line for the Clippers. James Harden. On a line for one. Hardy, he's checked in for Dallas. The substitution for you know, for, for the Dallas. Number 25, John Hardy. And they now lead as the free throw drops for him. You know, Steve, the last couple years, league-wide, scoring is way up for teams, but also for individual players. What's your read on that? Well, I think from the scoring situation, uh, defense is totally different than what we played. It's more free floor. Also, the three-point shot, they're taking way more three-point shots, long rebounds, and they have fast break, more fast break and transition points. But it all comes down to shooting three. Four threes, three more points. Irving, Irving, Irving. They are attacking the rim and getting great results. For Los Angeles, they've gone two or three from the field here, open the second quarter. Harden kicks to Zubats. Howell for three. Back to Zubats. In the corner, Powell with it. And it's Kyrie Irving with the rebound. 
And, and typically he has the touch to finish when he's in tight, but not sure. Kyrie, okay. that one falls. The bus driver with the ball in his hand. Kyrie keeps the defenders off balance. Now here's Leonard. No scoring in this one. And the Vika Zubac for two. And that assist got him a little nod from his teammate after that. Powell against Irving. Here's Hardy. And that one's off. And this is his first shot of the game for Los Angeles. They've gone 50% from the floor in the second quarter. Three of six. Leonard kicks to Harden. George looking around. Pass to Zubac. Evika Zubac from Paul George. With the nice assist. there by Paul George, just getting the ball to the open man. Injuries have hampered Paul George over the last few wiped out. But when he's healthy, he's, 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 he's still a go to option offensively who can guard the league's top wings. And as he's aged, he's really embraced a leadership role. Here's one the Mavericks making the shot. Harden outside. Down to five on the shot clock. Powell, the pass to Leonard. Over Washington. And again. Kawhi Leonard. Kawhi Leonard is a finals MVP. In large part due to that mid-range shot. He is automatic for that area. Washington finds Irving. And uh, almost four minutes gone here in the second quarter of play. And the top right you right oh. This tug of war game is And guys, that's lucky number seven already in this game. Here is Harden. He has seven. James Harden. Number two. We'll see if they can finally hold on to a lead. It's been back and forth all night. Both teams putting forth their best efforts right now. This is the kind of game fans pay to see. Now, here's Hardy. Nothing on the board. Count the basket. Y'all have Hardy. Bricks lead by one. Just taking what the defense allows, and that's a shot he'll make all night. And the best two later. Takes it to power. From deep three point land. Rebounded by Hardy. Powell with the steal. And pushing it up. Here's the Clippers. Back to Harden. A chase. Harden. Paul George with the assist. Dallas backs. Timeout. First timeout here for the game. Coming into this, having asked to win against the Rockets in their last game. Yeah, they got to a terrific blow offensively, but a lot of that was because the defense they were facing was mediocre. Yeah, it seemed like they got every shot they wanted. I'm sure they wish every game could be that way. And I expected that that this one might be the only thing I was uh, usually talking for, but in that case for now, there may not be anybody who really would like to be there. Well, especially if you get this one over a gun. Hopefully, they're gonna finish it so on, because that drive won't be helpful enough if they get there right away. And it's not always easy because that one took it over way many times. That may be the biggest difference over here, but that one is, may not be uh, improvable enough, well, hopefully, we'll find out if they do. Well, you guess it might be the only day it's just going to like keep on coming it down. Let's find out who it is. We may never know. What will it be? All right, let's go back over to David Alt, to Kevin Harlan. And the halftime show will be coming up underway after the first half. All you, Kevin. And the Angeles will go for a different look here. Mason Plumley's checked in for Zubox. P.J. Tucker comes in for Kawhi Leonard. Mann's checked in for Norman Powell. And Bones Island subbed in for James Harden. And a new group getting ready for Dallas. Daniel Gafford's checked in for Powell. Maxi Kleba comes in for P.J. Washington. Exum, he's checked in for Green. And Luka Doncic subbed in for Harden. And here is Los Angeles now. Terrence Mann! Going to the 
And Paul George with his six. Yeah, gotta chalk that one up to some shaky defenders. In a close game like this, everything has to be challenged. And everything has to be earned. And it's the Mavericks with the ball. The Clippers getting the bucket. Now, Exum. Still without a basket. Nope, not that time. Nothing for two from the field. And I like what they've been doing down low in the post. Pass to Highland. Here's Mann. And Public kicks to George. Six on the shot clock. And again. Oh, George. Number two. He's from out Mason Public. And to do it often. Two, two minutes remaining in the first half of the period. Two, two minutes. Good. And the assist are here with me. Assisted in by. Doncic has got four assists. And guys, they continue to put a lot of pressure on the interior defenders with their work down low. Tucker finds George. Here is Plumley, covered by Gaffer. Here's Tucker, and it's rebounded by Dallas. The defense was begging him to take that shot, and he took the bait, but you can't blame him. Only with the steal. We've got 123 left in the first half of the game. Passes it to Mann. Plumley in the post. Mason Plumley from Plumley. From Terrence Mann with the assist. For the Clippers. And look at how the hustle game has been going for the Clippers. For me, they're turning defense Daniel into Gaffer. offense. Creating opportunities by taking the ball away. Great effort. And one other thing that stands out. All the block shots. I mean, staying up in their jerseys tonight. Mann passes to George. Here's Plumley. And here's Tucker. Still yet to score. Over Kleba. Tucker can't get it to go. That's a shot he's got to hit. You don't get many looks better from that range. And it's Doncic missing. Clippers leading by three. Five second differential between the shot clock and the game clock. Pass to Mann. And here's George. Island with it. Shoots over Dodge. Island. And the Clippers lead by five. Wow, the vision of PJ Tucker made that play possible. Here's Dodge. Impressive. Dodge. Man, this guy is a scoring machine. I mean, I know I'm not the only one to the score. And that's the end of the first half. To the Los Angeles Clippers, 41. Clippers. Dallas Mavericks, 38. Now to go courtside as we send you over to David Aldridge from the sideline. David, take it away. Here with Ty Lue. Good rhythm for your offense in the first half. What did you like about the start? Uh, looking the basketball, taking the right shot, making the right play. We make that extra pass, we attack to the beat. You were sure tough in the first half, Coach. Thanks. Back to you. All right, David, thank you, and stay with us, folks. We'll be back just after halftime to get the third quarter started. The 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hey, folks, welcome back. Ernie Johnson alongside the Jet. That's Kenny Smith, the Diesel. That's Shaquille O'Neal. A lot of big-time action so far in this one. A pretty close game for the Clippers throughout the first quarter. In the first period, their biggest lead was a slim three points. They created some momentum for themselves in the second and went into halftime up by three. Kenny, what would you think about the Clippers? They found a slight edge on the boards, and they've done it with nothing but strong determination. I mean, look, they've got talent, but the passion is there, and that separates these guys. They're simply refusing to give up possession. Looking at Dallas, Chad, what your thoughts? They were really efficient, great approach offensively. Their shot selection was first rate. They were always working hard to get good looks. That can't change in the second half. They need to be just as well organized as they have been so far. That about wraps it up. Time now for the second half of the game. We go to Kevin Harlan for the call. You've been watching the 2K Sports Halftime Show. 
said after a fairly even first couple of quarters, the second half could turn out to be a quick one as both teams try to gain an edge. One of the stories here, James Harden getting it done today. Yeah, it's been a great performance from him. Really staying focused on quality shots. And many of those quality shots have been jumpers. A very high percentage of those in the first half. And if you're just joining us, we played through the first half in a game that's been fairly even so far. Getting underway in the second half, here's the five for Jason Kidd. The star backcourt of Dante Chinner of Inner out there. Garrett Jones is out there. Boys! Leonard! For two! In the five, rolling the pace. Uh, we like right the boys here from Leonard. Doesn't need to the Terrence Burns with the assist. The and there's the pass to Washington. Tips outside. Three pointer. It's held in by two bucks. Not quite enough defense. That time around, just lucky he was off. Back to Leonard. Kicks to George. It's a nice passing here by Los Angeles. Here's two bucks. He becomes two bucks for two. Seven point Los Angeles lead. Irving. James Branch. James Branch. Pass to Doncic. That's the free fly. Gets the, the drop. Donkey. And he's shooting for a three. five for eight clip. For the skill of Doncic at 6'7, 230, it makes him an impossible matchup defensively. Pass to Leonard. To the left side wing. Man. Right side, George. Over Jones. George, no good. The defense is right there. Quality contest, and they threw him off his rhythm. And Jared Jones, Jones Jr. Jr. Uh, just a super unselfish guy. Good good. Don't don't it's all for getting his guys going. Enjoys setting the table. And George kicks to Leonard. Harden outside. Looking at all that small on the numbers. Uh, 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 James Harden. That is four sports low ball. And he's an elite glass eater. A factor inside among the top ten in rebounds per game. And his ability to control the lane is a difference maker for that team. Exceptional timing and, and anticipation. That's why he's a top ten shot blocker. Now here's Jones. He's averaging just around eight and a half points. Offensive and foul on the Mavericks. Luka Doncic, the second first goal foul. Beyond the leaning, the conclusional award is on that screen. Easy call. So difficult to stay planted, especially with all the motion. Number zero, Russell Westbrook. Turnover. Los Angeles making a switch here. Westbrook's checked in. Zubac kicks to Leonard. The pass to Zubac. Near the three-point line, it's Westbrook, who's back up, in the corner, Harden, the three from George, and Jones pulls it down. He's tried to get it going, but the shots simply have not been there. Nothing seems to be falling. Anjic passes to Hardaway. Down low, here's Jones. Jones, 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 Here's Washington, and DJ Washington with the extra effort on the glass. And the Mavericks lead by two. And of the last six baskets, five have come on the interior. This is just smash mouth physical basketball, guys. Now, here is George. Right now, he averages nearly 23 points a game, a relentless offensive force. Harden, no good. Here are the Mavericks now. Right now, they're a 9 nothing run. Fifth best Kawhi Leonard. 
on a line for dollars. For the Memphis. Tim Hardaway Jr. on a line for JVM. Have been in key moments for his team. Take a break, take a break. Two shots. And the first one drops. And this is the official for the LA Clippers. This is number 24. Norman Powell. For George. And Norman Powell subbed in for James Harden. Josh Green's checked in for the Mavericks. And for, and for the Clippers. Number 20, Daniel Feist. And number 14, AJ Coffey. Hardaway hits them both. And the Clippers oh, are out. Here. And the lack of rim protection, top of the list. And it boils down to the question, toughness. One team showing it, the other allowing itself to be bullied. Plus, they're always being bullied out, but there might be not be anybody who really wanted it there. Well, not for always at once. The NBA Playoffs on 2K Sports is brought to you by... Starry Lines. Your local Kia dealers. A moment that inspires. And by Adidas. While we're working our way right now, we have it coming up for tomorrow tonight as we have the next game coming up here at that will be at 7.30 p.m., which will be the Knicks versus the Magic here at Orlando, which will be getting here right on the next game. After this one, and then we'll have some a little bit of a switch up commentators. And then before that will be the final game, Nuggets versus the Warriors. Now let's go back to Kevin Harlan and the crew. Kevin? First trail by four. To the left wing. Now, here's Tice. Already close. Kawhi Leonard for two. From Daniel Feitz. Now, here's Doncic. 12 points for him. Off target with his three. You know, Steve, you have to respect a guy like Norman Powell who embraces his role on this team. I definitely do, Kevin. Norman Powell isn't chasing the spotlight. He's working to support his team and really embraces his role on the floor. Yeah, let's go to that time either. You know what, though? They keep calling his number despite the difficult quarter he's had. Tice passes to Leonard. Powell against Washington. To the wing right side. Rocket six. Eleven feet away. It's rebounded by Dallas. Outside Hardaway. And it's set back by Leonard. Swallowing up shots like none other. Leonard stout on the defensive end. Basket. Oh, I John Puppy with the six. Second half, he's taking advantage of what the defense. defense. Here's Hardaway, and then Hardaway. Yeah, and Hardaway Jr. Once he gets clear off the screen, there is no stopping him. <laughs> no, not when there's a flush waiting to happen. That's a big time move and a big time finish. Oh, here's Leonard. He's got eight. Nice ball movement by the Clippers. Newman Powell for two. From Kawhi Leonard. What he said. Four and three point shots here in the third. Doncic dishes to Hardaway. Two minutes remaining in the third period. Two minutes. Two minutes. 156 left here in the third. Out of bounds. And it's Dallas ball. Last touch by Tice. 
Lewis with the traditional chin with Dallas Mavericks, number seven, D. White Powell. And checking back on the court, number 44, Mason Blumley. Powell against Hardaway. Just five to shoot. And that pass gets down. Yeah, it's close. a goal. It's the goal to Nicole right there. And Mason Just Blumley. Barely. Two more of the bats. On the way down. He's already Three substitution over for the Mavericks. So number zero. For going for yes. Bones no. Island is jacked in for the Clippers. Bones Island is jacked in for the Clippers. There's a minute 47 left in the third quarter. Number five, Harrington Island back on court. He kicks it to Powell. Pass to Plumley. Here's Island. Here's Tice. He has yet to score. Now Plumley is over Powell, and again it's the Clippers missing. Now here's Hardy. He's defended by Island. Up again, great position with that. And the Mavericks lead by four. And folks, he did not luck into that one. He knew just where he wanted to be to grab that back door. And Kofi! Uh, Norman Powell with the assist. Execution. Passes it to Kleba. Now Powell. There's 47 seconds left in the third. Up there for Powell, and the Powell. Powell. And how about the incredible timing on that? Um, he he absolutely party. hammered it down. Island with it, as to Tice. Here's Coffee. Powell for three. Powell pulls it in. Now, here's Exa. Guarded by Powell. Powell picks to green. 16 seconds left in the third. The pass to Pop. Look at Dallas Pop. His composure. Dylan Exxon. His first one's a little shot. He's getting his first free throw attempt of the night right now. The line for Los Angeles Clippers. Norman Powell. A line for two. Substitutional change for the Los Angeles Clippers. Number 17, E.J. Tucker. And number 14, Terrence Mann, back on the court. And so Powell nails both of them. Outside Irving. A floater. It's over. And that's the end of the first quarter. Los Angeles Clippers. And we're coming right back. Stay with us. It's 57. For the fourth quarter. A lot of time left right now, but we got one more minute to go. I mean, there's only one quarter left, but, but there's a lot much time left. Let's see if they can get their back through. You're watching the NBA playoffs on 2K Sports. Be back after this. And how about a look now at our assist to the game? Brought to you by State Farm. And he's always been the favorite to bag this honor. These kind of feeds are his bread and butter. This is what you need your floor general to do. Take charge, lead by example, unselfish play. It's time for the fourth quarter. Everyone, make some noise and get low. So with Hunter on the bench, here's who Teron Lewis going with. Man in and shooting guard with George at small forward. E.J. Tucker is out there with Ivica Zubac. And it's Harden in at the one. Now is Harden. To take the lead. 
the rebound by Washington. Washington's got his fifth rebound in this one. Doncic feeling it out. Got a piece of it. Here's the break. And here's George for three. Three ball. George. On one. And now we'll get a perspective here on the hustle game. How it's been going for the Los Angeles. Their defense, it's their defense. It has been downright incredible so far. Being disruptive and coming up with steals left and right. Curry, okay. They also made a this point to not. protect the rim tonight. All game Look long, they challenging or blocking shots. Here is Hart following the basketball. Out of bounds. Out of bounds. Dallas ball. ball. For the Clippers, number one. Here's the additional board, number two. Oh, so I love her. For Terrence Mann. A few possessions into the fourth quarter, just over a minute played. And here's Dodgic from the arc. It's held in by Zubats. Zubats has got four rebounds now tonight. Pass to Westbrook. Kicks it to Hart. The three. Russell Westbrook starting to see it. Well within striking range. Now is when you have to lock in at both ends. Now here's Jones. Some nice passing here by Dallas. Yep. Look up, Dominic. Let's see if you run. Dominic might lead. And so it's Leonard with it. He'll bring it up for Los Angeles. Outside Westbrook. Back to Leonard. In the corner, George with it. Shot clock at five. And Paul George. Points for Paul George. Aggressive. And Roy Leonard with his hits. He wanted that one bad. Irving passes to Washington. Irving against Harden. Let's it go. Irving misses. The Clippers in the lead. Leonard finds Zubats. Back to Leonard. Passes it to Harden from outside the arc. The Mavericks pull it in. It's off to Charlotte for him after this game as they take on the Hornets. And that game will be game two with three straight on the road. George against Jones. Now, here's Washington. He's tightly guarded. And the rejection by Zubats. Great awareness on Jones there. George Jones is blocking the shot. This is why he came Washington. Los Angeles has gotten off four three-pointers in the final quarter, and two of them have fallen. Over three and a half minutes through the final quarter now. Westbrook kicks to Zubats. The Clippers need to get off a shot. Here's Harden. And James Harden. He from the Lincoln Zubox. With the assists. Anjic passes to Jones. Washington with it. The kick out to Irving to take the lead. And that's out of bounds. Out of bounds. Dallas ball. <laughs> Tim Hardaway Jr. takes up the three goals. Hardaway over Dallas. Number 10, Tim Hardaway Jr. Five on the clock. Townsend from deep three point land. On this that time, would have put him up. Man, at what point do you blame the play calling more than the player? And George kicks to Zubats. Westbrook against Dunchich. Harden outside. Back to Westbrook. And Russell! Westbrook! Four 
point was him for the speed. The big target would be set. This is from Russell Westbrook. Going by Dallas Mavericks. He still gets it to Paul. Dallas calls timeout. The guy to like what Harden has done in this game so far. We have to make it harder for him to score. Deny the ball, even double, whatever it takes to force someone else to beat you. We're getting down to the end of the quarter right now as we got tonight's game on its way. As you're ready to wrap things up here, ready to start things off for the next game. Orlando Magic going on over here the lost first game against the New York Knicks. Hopefully they can try to step it up in between and they can keep on going. But we'll find out how well they do, and that's coming up after this game. Now it's time for your New Balance Player of the Game. All for you, Kevin. Who do you have? And now a moment to present the New Balance Player of the Game, Kawhi Leonard. He's provided them with a major mismatch on that low block tonight. That They've been able to lean on his scoring in the paint. And if nothing else has worked, he, he's given them a reliable option on every possession. And now we've got some time to check in from the sidelines. You got for us, GA. Thanks, guys. Well, I got a chance to listen in on what Jason Kidd was talking about with his players. You know, he had some pros and cons. He said, I like our play inside. But what's happening at the arc, fellas? We got to start making some shots. He needs more production from the outside. Guys. Thank you, David. Now here's Hardaway. Here's Doncic. Yes, that goes in. Luka Doncic. She's got four points in the quarter. I like Clippers timeout. From Doncic, right there. He ups the ante when it's a critical possession play in the game. And the Clippers call time here. Well, it is a player's lead, but certainly coaching has its place. Yeah, if that weren't the case, you wouldn't see so many coaching changes in the offseason. Well, that might be the offseason with that one here. And Luka Doncic, close game, 67-65. We'll be right with you shortly. The NBA playoffs in 2K Sports is brought to you by Sour Patch Kids. Sweet, sour, gone. Ruffles, the official chip of the NBA. And by AT&T. 5G lets you up to connecting changes everything. We're nearing down to the post game as we're getting this one right under the post uh, to show what is going. That will be the post game show underway right after this game. I'll uh, be we'll seeing what's going on right in between with Tyler and Terry. Back to you. But I'll see you guys in the later on the other side. And so Harden will bring it up for the Los Angeles Clippers. Giving up just eight points in the fourth quarter. Clippers moving the ball around. Puts it up from 15. James Harden! George is getting the last side half goal by Dallas Mavericks. has been the hallmark right now down the stretch. He is making the most of his opportunity. And the Mavericks call time here. Jerry's man. Man, man. 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 Man.
terrific pass. No other reduces. He lines up the alley with pass. Oh, a nice defensive play to disrupt the alley hoop. And they're on the break. Ahead. Go high, Mono! Here to make it a three point play. Fouls on Dallas. Luka Dukic. His first personal foul. First team foul. First team foul. The line for the back for the Clippers. Noah Leonard. At a line for one. And the Mavericks with possession here. Trailing here by eight. Inside, Gafford. Daniel Gafford. This location on the pass as usual. Or my junior. Man, perfectly. Harden kicks to Zubats. Back to Harden. Outside line. Shot clock at six. Here's George. Takes it inside. Oh, George. PG 13. Eight now for the Clippers. So slippery when he's driving the ball. Paul George makes it look easy. In the corner, Hardaway with it. Washington, the second team. DJ Washington. Yeah, that's a pure hustle play. Getting to the offensive glass for the tip. And that's the kind of quality you see in any strong offensive rebounder, isn't it? Now, here is Harden. Now the pass to Zubats. Here's Leonard. Six oh, hi, Leonard. Any position? James Harden with the assist. A master in the paint. Zubat to Gibbs Dungeon. Took him no Luka time. Luka Dungeon. Incredible. Dungeon decides he wants to take over it. And it's his personality. He comes up with the goods on that one. So they foul intentionally. Not all wrong. Dallas Mavericks. Eric Jones shoots. That's second personal foul. Second team foul. Line for the Clippers. Oh, high letter. For two. Now the first. That makes it a seven point lead. You know, Kawhi. He's on the visual on the court. Number on zero, the floor. Russell Boy, Westbrook. His actions speak for themselves. Russell Westbrook in for James Harden. So he goes two for two at the lock, and it's an eight point game. We've got 33 seconds left in the fourth. Guys, let's just go ahead and call this one. It's over. They couldn't make enough plays when it mattered. Interesting game, though, in terms of some of the matchups. Zubox finds Westbrook. 15 seconds left to play in the final quarter. Just find the shoot. The shot clock by the shot off the Dallas ball. The final substitution on the court for the Mavericks and for Clippers. Los Angeles Clippers, 82. Dallas Mavericks, 74. I think they built off that edge of being here and they're playing with just a little more confidence than their opponents. A check shot and send it over to David Aldridge, standing by courtside. David. Thanks very much, James. You have seen every type of defense from opponents over the years. What do you enjoy about that back and forth challenge? Every single game, trying to figure out what they're doing and how can I uh, be aggressive and take it. And I love playing in basketball. I love you know, being crafty and just trying to compete at a high level every single night. It takes a lot, but I'm going for it and uh, we just continue to do more. 
Uh, who won the chess match tonight, man? Congrats on the win. Back to you. All right, David, thank you. Well, folks, that's going to do it for now. For Steve Smith, Craig Anthony, and David Alden, this is Kevin Harlan thanking you for tuning in. See you next time. Kevin, thank you so much. What a great win for the Los Angeles Clippers in Game 2 as they finally made an answer back. And here's the thing. I know the frustration turns to be for Luka Doncic, but don't be complaining about it because that may be happen to be what's going on. And right in between there, you may never know what's going to happen like that. They worked so hard enough and they've never been flying it to keep on going. It's like a win to get on to tied this series up, and they were definitely doing it for a harder impact. Here's how you did with the total statistics. Los Angeles Clippers had a 56, 20%, and 100% on field goals, three-pointers, and free throws that made. That's excellent, but only fast break points was 12 for Los Angeles. Then, points in the paint was 52, and 12 for the second chance points for Dallas Mavericks. Bench points was 22 for Los Angeles, and 33 was the Los Angeles Clippers too. 10 offensive rebounds for Dallas Mavericks, 20 defensive rebounds for both teams. Then 7 steals for Los Angeles Clippers, 6 blocks for the Clippers with 5 turnovers and 2 team fouls, 10 dunks performed for Dallas Mavericks, then it was 8 biggest lead for Los Angeles Clippers, and even it up in between. But 17.57 was their time of possession for the Clippers. Well, that's all you all do for now, I mean, you've just got to like get off to it. And now it's time to present your New Balance Player of the Game. But first, three-star players. Tyler, all you. Okay, thank you so much now. Now it's for time for the third star of the game as I get started things off here. Kohai Leonard has gotten 20, 15 points, six of, it, six of a rebound, and of course, four assists. He got one block and two steals. 6 out of 10 field goal range, and he definitely had 23 performance effort. He's been doing excellent. All of his work for credit does have it paid off. He's been doing really well. Now, on for number 2. Next one now goes over to James Harden with 18 points, 3 assists, 1 steal, and only got 7 out of 13 field goal range, 1 3-pointer out of 7. Then it was 24 performance effort. Just did really well, and I can tell you now that that one has to be like a great idea for the Peter man to score big. And your number one star goes to Luka Doncic with 21 points, 4 rebounds, 6 assists, 9 out of 17 field goals, 3 three-pointers were made, and 9 out of it. Then it was 33 performances on the effort. Well, I guess that must have been turning out to be that great. But you can't get rid of that. Luka Doncic, the early tipper. Well, I guess that's pretty much it for the first couple of games in the afternoon. Stay tuned. We got later games tomorrow. And for everything, for tomorrow night, we'll keep you eyes up here shortly. But enough of that chat. This will be, happen to be the end of it. So, we're getting ready to change things up now. Switch to swapping musical chairs. And then we'll get ready for tonight's game. As the Knicks take on a magic at 7.30. Coming up after this break. We'll see you all later on the other side. Forward on the court. Peace out for a while as the NBA playoffs on 2K Sports Style. This is Terry Crews and Tyler Beast signing out. Take care, everybody. If you don't, if you don't, somebody will.